All right, so it's the first day. I finally am able to record this in private. You might hear talking in the background with some of these clips and stuff, but this is day one of me being in Hawaii. I'm in uh, Mai, not Mai, uh, Oahu. For lunch, I had pansit noodles with barbecue chicken, a huli huli chicken, barbecue chicken. I forgot what the place is called. Here it is right here. But you know, yeah. <laughs> I went to a place called Maragame Udon. I got the Nikutama Udon noodles. There's a little bit of broth down there. It's very strong broth right here that I heated up. The line was very long, so I just decided to order and nobody was waiting on their order. It's pretty good. It's kind of sweet. There's some dashi there. Imagine there's some soy sauce in there. Uh, maybe even mirin. I could be wrong. I'm not professional in Japanese food, but that's why I'm going based off my taste and what I've tasted before. Definitely got on the sweeter side. It's much, it's really flavorful. Got some umami to it. I believe that's udon, which is like onions, thinly sliced beef. Uh, I got a little poached egg in there. I got an extra one by mistake. I uh, didn't need to do that one, but I taste it. Tastes slightly different. This is really like, really got hit. So I got some seafood stuff, like seafood flavor. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to dip noodles into this or not, but I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to just pour that in there. Cause I did order it separate to set it up myself. It's gonna be my first meal out here in Oahu. I'm just gonna pour that in. Very hot broth. I do wish I had some green onions though for freshness. There's no green onions in here. I'm gonna try the beef. Tastes like udon. I will say it's not the best udon I've had, but it's still very delicious. <laughs> I'm not good at this review stuff. I'm just gonna give this a good mix. Who doesn't love udon noodles? I'm gonna break the yolk and kind of coat a little bit of some of the noodles in it. I got a little bit of the, the beef. I'm gonna get some broth. Eh. <laughs> it's so much. Oh, so I got the broth in here. Hmm, that's good. I like it. Like I love, I love the flavor that the yolk brings to this broth. It gives it even more umami than it already has. Adds to that sweetness and combines very well with it. One thing I will say is, I feel like there's not enough beef um, just by looking at it. I guess that's my review. If you come to Oahu, try it. It's great. I definitely would eat at this place again. Probably for lunch though. I guess other stuff, we drove around a bunch. It felt like we were driving around the whole island for like four hours. Yeah, those noodles and barbecue chicken was all right. It was something good to fill your belly and nice and cheap. This was $15. I guess one other thing I wanted to try is I got this paste uh, gochujang togarashi, like a spice in Japan that they use. That's good. It has very, very little kick, but it's enough kick to kind of fulfill that little spice craving. I'm just gonna mix it in and try to get it in. I got really nice sweetness to it. Adding more sweetness to this, it still tastes pretty good though. I might as well just take the whole thing out. Just, <laughs> I'll take a little bit more though. <laughs> Have a good one. <laughs> I would